Polish Defense Minister Marius Baszczak approved the deal for the supply of battery modules for the Atoker Broza tank destroyer for the Polish army. The first prototypes will be ready next year. This is reported by DEFENC24. This is a matter of a contract for the implementation of the Atoker Broza program, which began in 2019. The contract was signed by the Armaments Agency and the PGZ Atoker Consortium, which includes Hudas Tolowa Wola, Mesko, and Wojsko Zakbady Elektronich. In addition, such an agreement covers the entire cycle from production to delivery and further modernization of weapons. After signing the contract, Defense Minister Blaschak emphasized that the first prototypes of tank destroyers will be ready next year and will go to THE 14th Anti-Tank Artillery Regiment stationed in the Suwakai Gap area. However, the first batteries will be ready approximately in three years. Tests will be held already in targeted military units. Our task is to saturate the Polish army with such units. Each division will have anti-tank regiments. Our intention is that the first batteries will be ready within the next three years," the head of the Ministry of Defense said. Marius Blaschak emphasized that, due to the new weapons, the units of the Polish army will be prepared for the realities of the modern combat environment. In addition, he noted that the war in Ukraine, was a factor in the development of the Atoker Broza program and led to the acceleration of the re-equipment of the Polish army with anti-tank weapons. The Atoker Broza program was announced in 2019. Several Polish companies are interested in its implementation. Various versions of the tank destroyer were presented at the arms exhibitions. However, the final contract was signed only now. It is known that the Polish tank destroyer will be equipped with guided missiles Brimstone MBDA UK. The carrier was chosen to be a 4 x 4 wheeled armored vehicle offered by the company Huda Stolowa Wola SA in cooperation with Autosan and the Czech partner Tatra Exports Row. The detailed configuration of the components will be determined at the stage of concluding additional contracts. However, it is known that tank destroyers, command vehicles and artillery reconnaissance vehicles will be mounted on 4 x 4 vehicles provided by the Polish defense industry, while other mobile components will use JELCZ platforms. It is noted that each battery will have eight tank destroyers, one salvo will consist of eight brimstone missiles. The battery will also have one battery commander vehicle, two platoon commander vehicles, two ammunition transport vehicles, two reconnaissance vehicles, two medical evacuation vehicles, one universal repair shop, one universal weapon container vehicle, and an electronics workshop.